Greetings, ladies and gentlemen. Puppy Review Stop here. Today, I'm going to be reading you a story about courage, a story about perseverance, and, of course, a story about sexual tension between a tripod. <laughs> and I bet you're all wondering, Puppet, wh wh why are you reading us this story today? Well, it's just because I'm not really in this short, so, you know, I gotta have, you know, some sort of cameo, so. Anyway, sit back. Relax as I read you the tale about a freak trying to conquer a tripod. This is Derek's Tripod Lessons. Yeah, I know, not the best title, but you know, you just deal with it. All right, all right, all right. So let me get this straight. You want me to teach you how to put up a, a tripod? Seriously, a, a, a tripod? Th these things are like the easiest things to set up, and you, you want me to teach you how to put up this thing? Are, 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 are you actually being serious now? Of course I'm being serious. I mean, well, why would you doubt me? Well, you know, it's just, it's, it's a tripod, for God's sakes. Come on now, anyone can put these things up. Oh, yeah, you, you, you would think that, right? That anyone can put up a tripod. <laughs> hey, yeah, anyone. Hey, yeah, any, any, anyone except me. Yeah, cause, you know, f f funny thing, every single time I try to put up a tripod, so something bad always seems to happen. Like, I, I don't know, the, the tripod will become sentient and start beating the crap out of me, or, oh, this is the best part, every single time I touch one, it just, woof, falls to the ground. <laughs> yeah, which doesn't seem logical, but for some reason, it, it just happens. <laughs> so, I thought maybe I could take a class on putting up tripods, but sadly, no college, you know, teaches a class like that, so I decided to do the next best thing, ask you about it, because, you know, you, you put a tripod, so I, I just wanted to know how, how do I pull one up properly, so, you know, it won't fall on the ground. Mate, I, I feel like you're over-exaggerating a bit, I mean, come on, it's, it's a tripod, it, it can't hurt you, yes, it can't, that thing will beat you to a pole! Seriously, this inanimate object will beat you to a pole? Yes, 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 so you, you better be careful. It's... It, it, it's a tripod. I, I know. But but it, it, it can't hurt you. Yes, it can. A tripod can hurt me. Yes, it will. Uh-huh. Yeah, you know, I think I'm going to go. Please, sir. Get out of the I, I, I need your help with what? I need to know how to pull up a tripod. Oh, you... What? Please, sir. I, I need this. I, I have been tormented by tripods for years, and I just... I, I just can't figure out why I, I've been doing everything in my power to figure out how to put one up properly. I, I sung to it, I, I talked to it, I, I even made it feel special. I, and I even took it out for dinner one time. And I think it's worked. And it always ends the same. In pain and just pain. Constant, con constant pain. Yeah, it's just, just, just endless pain. It, 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 it's terrible. But I, I, I want this to change. I, I want to end the endless cycle of pain. So please, sir, please, please. Teach me the way of the tripod! Oh, wow, you really want to conquer tripods, don't you? Yes, very much, please! <sighs> Alright, fine, I'll, I'll teach you the way of the tripod. Oh, oh thank you, Derek, you, you, you won't regret this, but of course, <laughs> I ain't gonna do this shit for free. Wait, what? Yeah, you're you're gonna have to pay up, buddy. Wait, wait you pay up? But, but this is tripod lessons. You, you wouldn't make me pay for that. I mean, we're friends, right? Yeah, 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 you're right. But I wouldn't make you pay for wasting my time. Oh, oh come on, man. How much do you want me to pay you? What? Well, that depends, you know, because there is a new anime Blu-ray that's coming out, and it costs about 50 bucks. Hey, 50 bucks for anime? Yep. <laughs> and I don't really have the money on me right now, so... I'm not going to pay that much. Come on, that, that sounds like a scam. Oh, Oh, it does? Because to me, it doesn't really. I mean, it's not like I'm giving you toilet paper or anything. Oh, oh, I see what this is. Yep. So, pay up. <sighs> Fine, I'll give you your money. <laughs> Great. I'm glad that we came to an understanding. And I wouldn't call this an understanding. All right. It's time to give you a lesson on the world of tripods. Oh, goody. All right. So, the first step in mastering a tripod is to treat it with care. What? treat it with care? Oh, really? Do, do you really treat these things with care, Fargo? Well, of course! Oh! Well, if that's the case, then why do they keep attacking you? Well, well, well exactly. So you really have no room to talk here, so 
Yeah, you, you gotta treat these things like women. You, you gotta be nice and gentle. You, you just can't rush these things, Farkle. These are delicate things. They, they're gonna be holding our camera, Farkle. We, we gotta treat them with respect, okay? So you just go up to them and uh, be all nice and gentle like and just say, hey, hey there, baby. Yeah, today uh, we're gonna be doing some stuff. I'll be okay with that. Good. Good. Wait, uh, did, did he just talk to you? Wait, what the? No. No, no, of course not. It, it's a tripod, stupid. Ugh. What I'm trying to say here is that you have to be careful with it. This is a very delicate object. You have to treat it with care, especially when you're picking it up. But before you pick it up, you, you want to alert it, telling that you're about to make a move on it. All right? So, hey, hey, baby. I'm about to pick you up. Are you okay with that? Good, good, good. Are you sure it's not talking? Yes, I'm sure it's not talking to me. See, look, look, everything is fine here. No, no resistance, no, no problem. See, you, you have to be careful with it. You, you have to make it seem like you're trustworthy. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really good to know. I gotta write that down too. And also remember, Farkle, whenever you're trying to raise or lower a tripod, you, you gotta be very careful with it. And also, you gotta go very slow because these things, these things are very sensitive. And also, you got. You gotta tell it ahead of time, so it won't freak out, because this this is all about trust. Can you, can you say trust? Yes. T -t trust. Good. Good, because this, this is all about trust. Watch me here. Hey. Hey, baby. Oh, how you doing? You doing good? Well, that's good to know. Are you sure you're not talking? Yes! I'm sure <laughs> I'm not talking to it. Oh, God, that's just for the demonstration. But So, yeah, I'm gonna... Gotta be touching you a bit. You okay with that? Good, good. So, yeah, the best explanation I can give for this is, uh, it's like a nice, clean hand job. Wait, wait, what? Yes, a nice, clean hand job. How would you know how that feels? <laughs> don't, don't ask me about that. But yes, see, it went down with ease because it trusted us. So... Do you think you can handle this, Sparkle? Yes, 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 I can. Your your advice has been very helpful. Well, then, my friend, then come here and master this tripod. I will, and thank you so much for your advice, Derek. <laughs> you know, you can thank me with the $50. Yes, yes, I'll pay you later. <laughs> Good, now, go there, my child. Go and conquer the tripod. I will, Derek. I will conquer this tripod. Yeah, that's right, because I am Farkle for Nancy, and I can do anything. Oh, there you go. Wow, I actually kind of feel proud of myself. Maybe I should do more teaching. Oh, tripod. Sweet, sweet, innocent tripod. I am sorry for how I've acted throughout all these years. You you, you had every right to treat me the way you did. I, I'm sorry. I, I just did not know the way of the tripod, but now, now I finally know how to treat you well. And I, and I, I hope you'll give me the chance to do it for you. So please, uh, allow me to handle you with care. I, I touched it. I touched it and nothing happened. <laughs> Finally, nothing happened. I'm so happy. Oh, wow, that was, that, 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 that was definitely unnatural. Huh, you know, I kind of thought you were over-exaggerating about the whole tripod thing, but I guess I was wrong. Wow. Wow, Tri tripods really do hate you. Derek, Derek, what, what happened? I, I did everything you said, but, but, but they still hurt me. What, 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 what happened? What, what did I do wrong? Um... I mean, maybe, maybe you said something to offend me. Offend? I, I was so polite. Um, maybe it's your face. But my face? What, what does my face have to do with anything? I, I don't know. I've never seen a tripod attack anyone before. How do you think I know the answers? But, but you're the tripod master. I'm no tripod master. God, what, what made you even think that? Because I, I always see you putting up tripods. And I thought, wow, he must be a master at this. What? It's just anyone could do that. But it's just, it never attacks you. And I just, I, I just thought if, if you told me, it wouldn't attack me. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's unfortunate, all right. Well, pie. Eh. Well, I'll see you later with that $50. Hey, can come back here? And, and I need to know how to do a tripod. And so Derek ran away as Farkle was screaming in pain. The end. Wow, that was a really good story. Huh, kind of feels like a waste of time. Ah, whatever, I did my best. Not every short can be a masterpiece. That's what I always say.